A bust out for Western Illinois. McClusack just inside the arc will hit it. She's not converting them. He's getting the open books and getting open, but he's got to convert those field goals. Just over 30% of a three for Sandifer. Nice look inside. Barnes to Wickman before the finish. Nice little give and go inside, and you can see why. Bring it back across. Eight on the shot clock. Covington, catch and release, and good. Hostel triggered into Bell. Bell from the elbow, he's got it. Smooth shot right there from Bell. And this is the time you, you need to start plucking away because right now Western Illinois is missing some shots on their end of the floor. How big was that right there? Covington attacking down the lane, lean and shot off the glass and good. Four on the shot clock. Barnes will hoist from three and hit it. Wickman will try to answer. He answers and gets knocked to the deck. Points in the game. Kusak got a man in the air. Crashing inside, missed, and the rebound flushed by Gilbeck. Here over the Panthers switching it up. And the turnover. Stole all the way in left. Good. A pretty good shot of leading at half. Wickman, quick trigger three. Got the roll. Got the friendly home. Then try the finish. Covington, three, good. And Covington makes them. Just don't give ground. Now Haas, three-pointers, good. Johnson straight on three, good. Yeah, what they're doing is. So the Panthers finding a little offense here, but a little late in the second half is here in the second half so far. Three by Wickman is right there. That was a deep one. Yeah, and if, if you're he plays fast, doesn't he? Cody hits the three and hits the deck. He shoots fast. <laughs> So briefly, the Panthers outscoring Western Illinois now 28 to 24 here in the second. That one at the horn, and the ball game has come to an end. And Western Illinois comes into the Klotchy Center, wins their first road game of the year in beating the Milwaukee Panthers 75 to 59 here at the Klotchy Center.